Process turning cheap gold into 99.99% pure gold involves a process known as refining, which removes impurities and other metals from the gold to achieve a high level of purity. Here is an overview of the process. Steps and how to do it. First, melting scrap gold to melt. and pour gold slowly into water. Gold to split into small pieces. For easy and quick chemistry for the next step. Mixing the aqua regia. The next step is to mix the aqua regia. This is typically done by adding hydrochloric acid to a container, followed by the addition of nitric acid. Aqua Regia is a mixture of hydrochloric acid and nitric acid at a ratio of either 3 to 1 or 4 to 1. It is a reddish-orange or yellowish-orange fuming liquid. Fill Aqua Regia acid in gold. Boil with 70 to 90 Celsius gold until melted. Aqua Regia is a highly corrosive mixture of nitric acid and hydrochloric acid that is commonly used in gold refining to dissolve and remove impurities from gold. Here is an overview of the Aqua Regia gold refining process. Filter gold water as clean as possible. Gold is a high percentage if it is much clean. Sodium metabisulfite is a reducing agent commonly used in gold refining to precipitate gold from an aqua regia solution. Here is an overview of the process of precipitating gold with sodium metabisulfite. Add the sodium metabisulfite. Once the gold has been dissolved in the aqua regia solution, a reducing agent such as sodium metabisulfite is added. The sodium metabisulfite will react with the gold ions in the solution, causing the gold to precipitate out in the form of brown powder or flakes. Filter the solution. The next step is to filter the solution to separate the gold powder from the remaining solution. This is typically done using a filter paper or other filtration method. Wash the gold. The gold powder is then washed several times with water to remove any remaining impurities or acid. Dry the gold. Once the gold has been washed, it is dried using heat or air and then melted into a bar or other shape. The resulting gold will be highly pure, with a purity level of up to 99.99%. It's important to note that this process should only be attempted by experienced professionals with proper training and equipment, as it involves working with dangerous chemicals and requires careful handling and protective equipment. The purity of gold is measured in carats or carats. The carat KT measurement indicates the proportion of gold in an alloy relative to other metals. 24 karat gold is considered to be pure gold, which means it is 99.9% .9 gold and 0.1% other metals. However, because pure gold is soft and malleable, it is often alloyed with other metals such as copper, silver, or zinc to increase its strength and durability. The most common karat measurements used for jewelry are tanked, 14 18 and 20 twacked. 10 karat gold contains 41.7% gold and 58.3% other metals, while 14 karat gold contains 58.5% gold and 41.5% other metals. 18 karat gold contains 75% gold and 25% other metals, and 22 karat gold contains 91.7% gold and 8.3% other metals. It's important to note that the carat measurement does not necessarily indicate the quality or value of the gold. Other factors, such as the weight and the design of the jewelry, can also impact its value. Hope you like our video. Please press share the video. Or leave a comment under the video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much.